Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Tanks Gaming today again with another Hearts of Iron 4 video where we try to flip uh, or where we will going to flip the Swiss again to the communist side uh, with the modded with the mod which actually uh, the mod is called Helvetia uh, Helvetia uh, which gives uh, Switzerland its own unique focus tree. Uh, the me people may call them Sinch, uh what they want, yeah. Uh, which basically gives, uh, I shut it off in the last video, so you can check it out, but we have our own unique focus tree, which is pretty amazing, in my opinion. Uh, she's done a, far, a great job so far. I did already make a couple of mistakes. Uh, we should have gone further down this tree first before we started anything else. So we could have sent some volunteers to Spain, hopefully. Uh, I am not quite sure if you still need like 30 divisions. No, but we still can't do that. We, we are now going down another focus tree at the moment. We're still doing some research here. And uh, as soon as we hit, I think, 240 light tanks. Let me just check one more time. Uh, edit. Yeah, as soon as we reach 240 light tanks, we will start to, to produce our first light tank battalion. Or brigade. Division. <laughs> A light armor to division. Yeah, well. Reading was never my strong suit. I'm actually dyslexic. Uh, you probably figured it out if you read my uh, video descriptions and everything like that. So the construction effort has been done. I need to go down this construction uh, thingy because, like I said, uh, I have like. It, it still takes till the end, uh, till September, till the second military factory, uh, civil factory has been done, and they actually start on the first military factory. And that kind of sucks. I need more military factories faster, and this national focus will actually give us the opportunity to do that. So we are improving our uh, popularity with the uh, Soviets, and uh, of course over here we are not uh, is still named player. <laughs> I still need to do the thingy uh, on Paradox website, uh, not website, but the launcher. I also can't save into the cloud right now because I still haven't done that. I still haven't registered myself. I'm still playing over Steam. So, um, yeah, whoops. Uh, on Swiss activity must be sp stopped. Political power minus tw 100. Change popularity, popularity of communists minus 10%. No. Uh, gains communist revolutionaries, which grants national unity minus 10 for 365 days. I ignore them. Uh, or the referendum is preferable to a bloody revolt, becomes a ruling party, public elections will not be held. So we will do that and we are the United Cantons again, right? Yes, so we are communist. We are a communist state in the heart of Europe. Uh, the Germans does, does, haven't even done the Anschluss of Austria yet. Uh, interventionism focus, defensive focus. That's whatever the French army innovation. So I think we do not have national. Uh, uh, the first, the uh, first time I told uh, the first video of the second try, um, they did not. Uh, what I was going to say, uh, I didn't know if this mod cancel out the non-historical AI. So it base it definitely does not. Otherwise, they would have started to do that stuff already. So we are improving our relations with the Soviet Union quite a bit, actually. Swiss opinion of Soviet Union plus 13, same ideology and trade partners gives us plus 3. Uh, of the United Cantons, improve relationships. Yeah, that's that's going to work out pretty nicely. Uh, down here, it's still not looking that great, actually. Uh, I think I could send some volunteers now, though. No, I still need 30 divisions, so okay. It wouldn't have mattered if we could, would have gotten down the other focus tree or not. But due to the fact we are now a uh, communist, we can change uh, the civilian economy into early mobilization. We could go to... Part Partial mobilization straight away. Um, but what does this give me? Construction speed, consumer goods. Um, minus 10% construction speed, minus 10%. 
plus 10% construction speed. I think I go with that one. That's even better. And I don't have to... Uh, for now, now, but I can go to extensive conscription if need be. But not, for, not right now. But at least now we are not using that money. I think I did the wrong thing, did I? Uh, 30%, 20 consumer goods factory. Factory is 25%. I'm an idiot. I should have gone... Uh, oh, no. 20%, 25%. I did the right thing. That's now like 20% just been used. Here 25% of the factories are used for uh, consumer goods. Here 30%. War economy will be nice. Or total mobilization will be even greater. But that will... The conversion cost... Actually, that's pretty good. That's just conversion cost. And actually the construction speed goes up afterwards even more. Uh, ah, recruitable population is minus 3% though. Uh, this one is, I think this one, War Economy, will be the best. For what I have in mind, at least. So how are we doing over here? We are up to 22 tanks, great! <laughs> Speed up the tank production. How many tanks we're producing at the moment? Uh, we are producing 3.5 a week, 3.6 a week. It's just not really a lot. It actually, it's pretty, pretty bad. We are nearly done with infantry equipment, though. Which is nice. Which is also very nice. Helps out quite a lot. The Italians have managed, uh, started to focus on us. As well as have the, the Germans. Okie dokie. Uh, the artillery has been resurged. So, uh, RT tank, that's 39 tech. Ah, 36 tech would be a light tanks, but yeah, I don't know. This one still takes 39 days to be finished. Uh, that's all 38 tech. That's even 39 tech. So, nothing in there. Could go down over here, one national focus tree, but I think I shouldn't. 37, 38 tech. Oh, 37, we can get a factory too. Which increases the factory output by quite a bit. And increases everything, which is pretty good, in my opinion. So the Germans are still not working on the Anschluss. No army innovation still. And the French are still working on the same thing. Yeah, defensive focus. So it takes a moment till actually everything has been done. And I really need to go down. Yep. The Hindenburg disaster happened. Oh, the humanity. Uh, so we have the railroads now. Our units are faster in moving around on the back. But I think I need to go down the anti-air. <laughs> ah, crap. I need more military factories. So another 70 days of that. And, and then I might switch my focus to... What was it called? To the fortification effort. Uh, and go down this tree for... Uh, well... Uh, spirit national redoubt which grants land for construction speed plus 10 with uh, national redoubt army experience <laughs> this gives just land for construction speed but doesn't give us the actual land forts this gives us 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 land forts this this and this interesting Yep. And this one, yeah, also gives us land forts. Eh, very interesting. I think I definitely need to go that, down that route. Pretty soon. Soviet withdrawal. After a build up of Japanese forces on the Marchunian. Ah, that, I think that is over here somewhere. Uh huh. Yep. I think actually this one up here. I think that's the Majurian. It's a global law. <laughs> but foreign claims, Soviet Union has some claims on it. So I guess that was that, or is that the Manchurian? No. I think it definitely was that. Well, the Soviets have actually claims on nearly everything over here. Well, actually, that's just Korea has some claims over here. So details, we have done the research on that thing. So we will go over here, which construction speed higher up. Always a good thing in the beginning early stages of the game. I mean, 37 now. Uh, there hasn't been actually a war yet. The Germans haven't done anything except 
reenacting the Rhineland or re remilitarizing the Rhineland. And of course, the, the Spanish Civil War is still going on. That, of course, is a thing. Uh, we can't go down mechanized yet. It's not 38 yet, so nothing in there. But we can go in here finally and get the field hospitals, which we will need desperately. Uh, the United States are doing what? They are guaranteeing quite a lot of people. Uh, they have a puppet. I'm going South America, whatever does, does, this does. Uh, I'm kind of amazed that the Republic of Spain is still existing, even though they just have Barcelona and uh, Valencia. Oh no, there is another town. Mur Murica, Murica, Valencia and Barcelona is just left. The rest has been overrun by the fascist Spanish guys, which is kind of interesting to me. Uh, the Soviets are doing what now? The Soviets are an ocean-going ocean navy. An ocean-going navy, so their navy has, sucks. 3TV, the USSR, the French are doing fortifying fortification focus. Fortify Malta. <laughs> the Brits are really focusing on Malta. I would love to see uh, what they have built in here. Uh, is that, like, really... Is it really the number which is there, or is it just like an estimate of my side? So Amelia Earhart died, if I read that correctly, or, or did she manage to do it, what she was set out to? I don't know, I didn't pay enough attention to it. Uh, we could also join to, to join faction, but doesn't make any sense yet. Uh, we could improve our relations a little bit more, which we will do. Because we need to. And actually, can we do something like... Yeah, that doesn't really bode well. Uh, but we could start to boost the popularity of communism. Just boost it a little bit. We might flip Germ uh, France into a communist state. Uh, so they can join the Soviet Union as well. So, my mountaineers actually... I think we could start some training. Okay, the construction workshop has been done, which is perfect. That gave me two building slots and two military factories. That would give me another military fact, two other military factories, and I think I want to do that. I think I really want to do that. Uh, yeah, 70, 70 more days should be good. Uh, of course, they put it in here, but I don't want it in there, and I don't want it in there. I want it in here. I want all the factories possible in light tank production as soon as yeah till we reach 200 actually that should be good they're producing now one a day well 1.5 a day marco polo bridge incident which doesn't really matter for us at the moment at least um should i or shouldn't i should i or shouldn't i innsbruck salzburg we could like justify a war goal against austria but how how close they're, they're actually not very close with the germans if the germans haven't made the anschluss until i get all my tanks and everything ready uh i think i will justify a world girl against austria and start to walk through austria and i definitely will go get a war goal against yugoslavia again because i would like to get parts of it for myself but i think for that i really need part of vienna here uh, a part of Austria, or actually Austria, so I can move down here. Hmm, that's interesting. Interesting, interesting plans. If any of them work out, we will see in the near future. I guess not, but... <laughs> no, you, I can hope, right? Yeah, like, yeah, now it's really like one tank a day. I think there was like, oops. Like, yeah, 1.5 tanks a day nearly, 1.43. I think it will go up to 1.5. Pretty soon uh, the rate is rising because you see it's rising up here as well. And as soon we will have like second, uh, second armament, second infantry. I wanted to say uh, second other stuff. Uh, we do not need to boost party popularity. We actually do have free civilian factories. Interesting. Uh, they are doing Stalin Constitution and the French are doing uh, Levermasse. What the hell is that? Uh, infantry equipment production costs minus 
Okay, and it gives them some army experience. That's good. And actually, the Germans are doing army innovations too. And the Austrians are doing... Um, construction efforts too. We have some freedom of civilian factories, which is pretty interesting in my opinion. Um, we are up to 10 over here out of 11. We are up to 8 out of 9. Which should work out if I do this and this. Uh, then we could like... Nope, that's completely built up. But we could increase the airport over here. And we actually will get all that we can out of anti-air in there. So the, up the construction should take a while here. Yeah, November 37. Actually, it's not taking that long to build that two factory, just those two factories. The airport and anti-air is even faster. So we might be done by the end of the year with the infrastructure updates and stuff. Which is cool. Um, whoops, Japanese build up on Chinese border. That's okay. Details, we have the two other military factories. Which is great. And uh, now I'm going to with the fortification efforts. Which is gr which also is kind of great. And Austria, actually. How many troops does Austria have? Apparently 14 divisions. Around 14 divisions. 10 to 40, 6 to 14 divisions. I think... Uh, it's quite a lot of mountains through here. I, I, if I have at least one tank division... Nearly, nearly, nearly there. World tension just spiked up to 23%, which is kind of bad. Uh, the Germans are not guaranteeing uh, Austria or anything. Uh, the Spanish Civil War is still going on. Just because of Barcelona, I'm really impressed that they still hold on to Barcelona. That's 39 tech, so we leave that B. Um, let's go with the radio and then the radar. Just because. Um, I think I have my 240 tanks. I do. So that means we are going to get an armored division editing. Oh, crap. Can we change it to... No, we cannot. Uh, mobile battalion, new, new group. 25 experience, so we can't do that. But we can train at least one. At least one, which will be spawned in East Switzerland. Uh, like, like, just one. For the moment. Because we have the tanks for it, we have the infantry equipment, we have the manpower, but nothing else, actually. So, uh, you are not guaranteed by anybody or so. So, that's interesting. I kind of like that. How are the Soviets doing? Should we still need to improve our relations? I think we're pretty good. I think we're pretty good. How about the French? Uh, how is it going with the party popularity? It's like at 50%. So the civil war in Spain has ended. And world tension went up to 41%. Took seven states, uh, was annexed. So uh, Spain is now a fascist country, which they were in like in real World War II time, real World War II times. Like they were in 1930s. Uh, okay, uh, what I was going to, yeah, over here, the coup, stage a coup, which would, which, would, how much would it cost? Um, 6,700 infantry equipment, how much do we have? Not that much spare. Definitely not starting a coup, though. So, we need to train up our tank division. Uh, how fast they're training. I actually could rush them out already or nearly if they reach 25% you can rush them out as green units I'd rather do do not this. I'd rather do not that this time. Uh, I'd rather have them train up completely Which would be much nicer. It's November um, 38 Should I get the next tier tank and then go down a medium tank tree and switch everything up to medium tanks later on? I think that's the, I think that's the decision to do and then get the medium tank 2 and then the medium tank 3 and then the modern tank. <sighs> I think that should be good. Yeah, I think I should do that. I think I'm shooting, I should do that. Uh, what's my national focus again? Uh, yeah, that one. 
Um, military factory will be done in January. January. And then we can build some land forts. Uh, this building inflicts an attack penalty of 15%. Uh, we can build quite a lot of land forts. We will do that, actually. We will fortify the hell out of Switzerland. And then I actually will take the attack on, 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 on Austria. And hope that they do not... Uh, research. And hope they will not get allied with the Germans straight away, which would really suck. Uh, even faster with the land fort construction speed. And I just enabled this, which I didn't want to. And... Yep. Two more factories. We are producing three tanks a day. Which is quite nice, actually. We are already a plus of 240 again. So I think I should get a second unit. Nope. At a unit. Which takes a little bit longer to be produced. But that's okay. And another 240? Nope, not yet. But tanks production is quite fast, actually. Which is nice, which is nice. I like that. It is 38 now. And I hope they do not join the Germans right away when I start a war against them. How long will it take to actually justify a war goal? It would take... Conquer... Select one to five states. Uh, 270 days. If I just go for Tyrol. 195 days. So... About half a year? Hmm. Details, that's good. Let's go to the national, this one over here. And then we see if we can get the Fortress Morton and then the Gotthard. But I think we can't. I think we need to get the Rütli report first. Which was actually pretty interesting. Uh, I told, talked about it in another... I can't. Yeah, we need the Ridley report. Okay, we cannot get those twos. Uh, we cannot go get those four. <laughs> and we cannot go get this one either. So we have to go down this side. Uh, this gives me three land forts in East Switzerland. In 70 days. Let's see where they will pop up. If they will pop up. I think they pop up. I can't stop saying pop up for some reason. Uh, I could get two more factors in here pretty soon. Actually, I already could, but I sh I'd rather not uh, produce that. And we are short on oil and nothing else. So oil, we can get another factory from. Just, uh, we could get an we could land another civilian factory to the Soviets. Which then, yeah, it's building up the airport very, very quickly here. It's like, uh, it's still in April that will be up to the next level. Uh, yeah, which is cool. Which is really cool. We're still waiting to see where the land for forts will pop up. Come on, show me the land forts. Show me the land forts. Show me the land forts. How is the production going of my tanks? Uh, those are 90% trained, which is nice. Those are 55% trained. Uh, combat modifier to zero. Uh, they're giving a combat modifier of zero as well. They will be ready on the 26th of April. That's good. So they've been built. Uh, Balkan diplomacy. The United Kingdom is preparing their strategy. I don't care about that. Uh, Rointal gives me another three land forts, and I think I'm going for that before I go down further this tree over here. I actually want to go down. I should go down all the way down to there. And I'm definitely going to place this uh, this mod again with normal Switzerland. I don't know if I'd make a playthrough. If you want to see, I think I will make a playthrough. Or a let's play. Uh, should I? Shouldn't I? Not 100% sure yet. I think I should. I'm pretty sure I should. Shouldn't I? Yeah, I should. Uh, the orange army. Ooh, light tanks too have been finished. Okie dokie. 
And can we research this one already? No, that's 39 tech, so we won't research that. Uh, down here, radar is coming along. Rest is 38 tech. This is a 37. We could get more steel out of the ground if we do those two. Um, that's a 39 as well. The 39. Uh, I'm researching down here. I could get the MP and everything. The rest is 39. This is 38 tech, so we definitely need those two to be researched pretty soon. And actually we can modify our government a little bit at least. So military theory gives me... Uh-huh. Definitely better this one. I think. And over here we have... Industrial research time minus 10%. Electronic research time. I think industrial is more important. Um, this one we can get small arms company, artillery, artillery design, motorized company, uh, motorization research time minus 10%, definitely not. Uh, artillery research time minus 10, small arms, definitely that one. And uh, down here, uh, we do not have the army defense, would be nice. Uh, yeah, definitely the army defense we will get first at least. Okie dokie. So one tank is actually ready and actually I will change up a little bit over here. So the I need a gold army. Yep, those six guys. And I will actually add this tank to gold army. And this like this. Yep. Gold army and delete the French front and you will actually get a new front which is over here. Let's try that again. I messed that up from time to time. Let's try that up, uh, like, no, still not. Like this, seven divisions will be part of this thing. And actually you will be added to uh, right click. No, that doesn't help. Can I not do that with this? Oh, I click on this one and then I click on this one. So as soon as they're ready, they, uh, they'll join a uh, gold army here and we will get a new commander. Actually, we don't need a new commander. Gold army has... Yep, gold army will get Hizu. Hizu. Uh, roll new commander, yep. And for, your, for this army, I also roll a new commander just because I have to experience and I rather have a new commander there than not so if we do that uh, like ma maximum efforts uh, like something like this just straight through delete that one again just straight through here and I probably need to add one mountain infantry to that as well don't die Probably should. Probably should add one amount of infantry to that one as well. So it's like eight divisions. Yeah, that should be good. Uh, we would just wait till the tank is ready to attrish, uh, attrition. To a tank is ready to join that as well. That should help out quite a lot. And actually, I should start my war goal against it. I think. I think that would be a great ender of this episode if we start to fabricate against uh, Austria. And hopefully they do, uh, they do not kill us by joining the Germans. So we are going to justify war goal and we are going to go against Tyrol. It, because it doesn't really matter. Uh, we could get upper Austria and lower Austria, but uh, yeah, 159 days. If we take more, it just takes longer till it's ready. And I need more political power to actually do that. So just like this. So send. And we are justifying against Austria. So let's just hope that the Germans or the Italians do not guarantee for Austria. Otherwise I'm in a big trouble. But anyway guys, that's going to be it for this episode. If you did like this episode, please hit the like button. You can also subscribe to my channel or follow me on Facebook or Twitter. The links will be in the video description. And like always guys, uh, uh, like I told you last time guys, uh, the link for this mod is also in the video description. And like always, guys, one more time, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.